A fire that, oops, broke out after an attack by Ukrainian drones at an oil storage facility in Proletarsk, Rostov Oblast, has not been extinguished in five days. The fire toll is 47 injured and the authorities have declared a state of emergency in the city. Russian authorities are diligently fighting the fire, that is true. They even sent priests who held a mass prayed to God, but that did it not help for some reason. On the contrary, even, and judging by the fact that the fire is approaching the diesel fuel tanks, it is about to become worse. Some may blame me for my smile and for being sarcastic. Well, I couldn't care less, actually. I just love to watch that against such a flaming background. The owners of oil depots in the region have already begun to sell their depots in this region. But that's not all. Ukrainian troops attacked a train ferry with fuel tanks in the port of Kafkaz. It was later reported that it successfully sank. Yes, successfully sunk. Hmm, lovely news. It had a total of 30 large tanks fuel. This was the only train ferry that the Russian actively used to continue to supply their troops in the occupied Ukrainian peninsula of Crimea. And now more good news for us and bad news for the Russian oil industry and refining industries in there does not end there. China has recently significantly reduced its oil purchases from Russia. The volume of oil supplies fell to 1.76 million barrels per day. This is the lowest since September 2022. In July of this year, the total volume of crude oil imports from Russia to China fell by 7.4% compared to July last year. The decline in fuel demand in China has continued over the past few months. If in March 2024 China was increasing the volume of Russian oil inputs, then in the second quarter already inputs began to decline. By July they fell by 30% compared to March figures. Even the May visit of Russian President Vladimir Putin to Chinese Chairman Xi Jinping could not stop this process in the following month, as the Moscow Times actually admits the decline in demand for Russian raw materials even accelerated. Mm, music to my ears.